good morning so sorry if it's too dark but this is the best lighting i'm gonna get i just had the most bizarre morning i was taking out the trash and then you see there's this stray cat that likes to hang around at our like driveway in garaje i don't know what garaje is in english there's this stray cat that just likes to hang out there i had been giving it just like water because it's so hot um it's been like a few months that I've been doing this, that I've been giving it water and it's been pooping in our driveway garage thing and it's so annoying because I have to clean it up so it pooped again I should say he because the cat's a male cat he pooped again which is so annoying I'm gonna have to clean it up later but the strangest thing happened today he's never done this before and I don't know what to do I don't know what to think um he brought in a dead pigeon I don't know why seeing that earlier was just crazy I don't know what to think I'm gonna have to dispose of it later I don't know how I mean I'm probably just gonna like sweep it up because I don't want to touch it that was how my morning went I mean it's still morning but you know what I mean so yeah anyway I don't know what to do
Hi everyone, good morning. It's been a while since I talked to you guys, I think. I think the last time that I talked in this vlog is... Was it Monday? Oh my goodness. <laughs> it's Saturday today. It's the weekend now. I haven't talked to you guys much this vlog just because I've been just focusing on doing my online course. Right now, I'm just going through all the lessons and then after that, I'm going to do all the assignments. Um, I think that's going to be easiest and fastest way for me to get this done. I've just been focusing on that this week because we did not have internet. We did not have internet since Saturday morning up till Tuesday morning. We just suddenly lost internet like out of the blue, out of nowhere. So my older sibling contacted customer service. They said some things to like help us troubleshoot, but things were still not working. And then they said that they were going to send a technician but they didn't give us a date or time, so we were just waiting for someone to call, someone to come. And then Tuesday morning comes, some guys came in and they checked the router because they thought that there was something wrong with our wires, but it was fine. And then they went outside and then they like did something with like a box. They moved it and then we got internet again. So I was like so happy that things were like resolved and stuff. And then yesterday, Friday, afternoon i think it was around 1 30 we lost internet again so my older sibling contacted customer service again and we don't know when they're gonna come i'm just hoping it's gonna be on monday because i have a meeting monday evening so yeah i just hope it gets fixed as soon as possible so yeah those things happen this week so yeah um today uh, i'm gonna be just i guess reading I'm gonna try my best to get through a chunk of this book that I'm currently reading. I'm actually in the middle of four books currently, um, but I've decided to not read um, How to Do the Work. This book, since I'm also in the middle of three other books, I'm thinking I'm gonna need to finish those three other books first before I continue with this one, because I really just want to take my time with this one. I think that would be best when I have all of my focus and attention while reading this book. The other books that I've been reading are Eating Animals by Jonathan Safran Foer. I am like about a third of the way through of the book. I've been enjoying it. I've also been learning a lot and considering that this was published in like 2009, there are like some like words that I knew of that were like being used in as like marketing stuff for like food and things like that but I didn't really like understand like what those terms meant and so he has like this whole list of just definitions for those words and there was so eye-opening so many revelations with this book and so many things to learn about so yeah and then the next book that i started reading was anne of green gables i finally started the audiobook for it i found a free like pdf thing online so that i could read along while listening and then the last book that i'm reading currently is the hobbit so i went to the province i got a couple of books to take back with me and this is one of them i already finished reading show your work during the weekend and now i'm rereading this one i just finished reading chapter two last night and i found an audiobook on youtube so i really want to listen along to that while reading this um i think it will be like a really fun experience but again like i said we don't have internet so i'm not going to be reading this one unfortunately i really really want to listen to the audiobook while reading this because I just think it'll be such a fun time. So because of, again, no internet, I've been mentioning that so many times. I'm so sorry. I'm just frustrated. So because of that, I think I'm just going to be reading this book this weekend. I'm also very slow reading this just because the subject matter is a bit heavy, you know? So I'm just like taking my time to really just absorb everything from this, I guess. Aside from that, I don't really know what to do today. I'm thinking of baking some muffins because I bought some ingredients for that like a couple weeks ago. So I think that's also what I'm going to do. Honestly, just during the weekends, I like to just relax and like watch stuff, you know, you know, just be like a couch potato. I'm just going to try to find things to pass the time because I don't like being bored because it's uncomfortable. So I'll talk to you guys again later i guess or tomorrow i don't know i don't know when i'll talk to you guys again but yeah
Good morning, everyone. I'm here today just to give you guys an update because of the previous clips. So we got our internet fixed yesterday. I was so grateful and so thankful because I just assumed that, you know, technicians also had weekends. So I didn't know that they were also working on Saturday. So I'm just super grateful and thankful that they were able to come here yesterday afternoon and like get things fixed. So I got to start the audiobook for The Hobbit last night and oh my god, I'm so so happy. I was watching one of Catherine Carras's like older videos of this year and she was listening to this Hobbit audiobook and that's how I came to know about it and so I wanted to try it out and listen to it. I'm so sorry that our neighbor's dog is barking right now. I don't know what's going on. So yeah, anyway, I was able to start the audiobook last night and it's so good. So good. I'm so happy that I was able to come across it um, from watching Catherine's videos. It's just so good. I'll have it linked in the description below because it's just, it far exceeded my expectations because I was just expecting like just the narrator speaking. But this is like so much more. This has like a full cast and there's also background music and you know like sound design and foley and it's just so good it's so good highly highly recommend you guys also listen to this audiobook if you hadn't already listened to it it's just it's so good it's such a fun time like the vibes are there it feels very like the lord of the rings and like the hobbit movies it's so good it's so good it's so good it's just amazing it's so good okay so moving on i'm also going to be able to continue listening to the audiobook for anne of green gables i'm currently on chapter three i've been really enjoying these audiobooks uh recently like just listening while also reading along it's just such a fun time i did not expect to enjoy listening to audiobooks as much but i think it's also because i found that i enjoy Listening to audiobooks that has a cast for the different characters, I find that the most fun to listen to and the most interesting to listen to. And I also really like ones that have like background music or like sound design fully in them. It just makes the whole experience like much more immersive and it just, it's so good. <laughs> Even though if there isn't like a full cast, kind of like how with um, the Bliss and other stories uh, audiobook that I listened to, there's only this one person um she narrated the whole thing but she also did the different voices for each of the characters so i appreciated that um i appreciate having different voices for each character i find that very helpful yeah i just i like it when there's like different voices for each character anyway um i have my blueberry muffin here that i'm gonna eat for breakfast this is one of the later ones that i made during the night this one i added some white chocolate chips on top but they've obviously like melted so it doesn't even look like white chocolate chips anymore. But yeah, I'm gonna have this for breakfast. I'll have the recipe for this in the description down below as well if you guys would also like to try it. It's pretty good. It's not too sweet. The sweetness is just right for me personally. In my opinion, I think it's just right. And yeah, I think this is going to be the last time that I'll be speaking to you guys in this vlog. So I guess I'll just like have my outro ending speech whatever's here i don't really have like an outro but i'll just say goodbye here for now and i'll see you guys in the next one so yeah bye